hit the clock and right. die. Okay. <laughs> what? Oh, I have never. Wow, that's so aggressive. Yeah. Oh no, not this line. The winter weary. What? This is not he been keeps playing. playing no. this stuff. Nice check. Yeah. Yeah, very nice check. Just kiss him. I mean, as checks go, that is a very nice check. Just what I would have done. If I was drunk. You're oh. not, you should be drunk. <laughs> All things in there, kidnapper. Look there, uh, clutter. Kidnapper. Clutter buns. <laughs> did I call him clutter buns? You did. No, you didn't. You me smelly. Well, you are smelly. Smelly what? Yeah, Muddicus. Muddicus ain't helping you. Smelly butt. Put that speed bishop on the proper square if you don't mind. I'm He's telling kid. you what's here. Do? Jeez. <gasps> Let's see, uh, I don't know. If you do that, I'm going to do that. All right, I'll do it. All right, I'll go ahead. That's very strong. What happened? Did I miss something? That's what I figured you'd do. You think? Just creeping in now. Yeah, you're creepy. I agree. Slowly creeping in. You're a creep. You're a creepazoid. Hmm. Hmm. Huh? What? Uh, uh, oh, shit. I thought it was me. Uh, uh, <laughs> as soon as he told me, I went, oh, no. <laughs> well, I owe you. Well, it could have been. That's I one thing you. I wouldn't do is go for I the baby. I do I See, that's the difference between me and you. You, you would go. Uh, and I don't want to Don't tell him. Don't tell stand. him. He'll, he'll learn. Going, you go to that one What's the matter? Depends on the weather in Vegas. I ain't going there in Vegas. In What's up? What's happening? Well, man, it's, it's indoors, but I can't deal you with it. You were talking some shit. Surely you have more shit to talk. Vegas. Something about Shirley, I don't know. You had to get out of your car and get in, in outside the parking lot and get, you walk to Whoa. inside the convention center. You don't want to talk shit anymore? You think a few feet away? Yeah, maybe. I'm oh, probably... I don't know, I'm going to be there. What's like... I mean, I was there in September. It was terrible there. Last September? 
Yeah, you're about to get Daved. In case you're no! Dave. Yes. He's yeah. promised you wouldn't do that He anymore. knows he's getting Daved. He knows. Yeah. Yeah. He knew? He knows. Oh. All right. I just had to figure yeah. out the meat. Uh, oh, really? Right now you got to figure it out? Once I knew I had the meat, it was it's sitting here. Oh, yeah. Any master can find I that. couldn't go into this until oh, I, really? he came Any down here. When he, he, he centralized his queen for material. Yeah. See, that's one, That's the problem. You start getting greedy about pawns. Never miss a good opportunity I don't see a defense to now. shut up. Never miss a good opportunity Just to shut up. Never miss a good opportunity to shut up. Kapish. Kapash. Hey, move. That's pretty strong. Pretty strong move. Don't check. Very good. something? It's uh, check. You're missing take. stuff, yes. Thank God I can't take <sighs> this I can't believe. There it is. What the hell? I thought I had a, I thought I had a uh, sacrifice. You got out of it. Yeah. You're a whole piece up. Who's turning here? Beginning. You don't have a I don't know what I was thinking when I took No, it. I don't have a defense. Right. God damn it. I'm sure I'm I'm it. I guess so. You're one move ahead of me, man. Damn it. <laughs> well, it's not mate one. It's mate two. Check him. Who does that do? Oh, yeah, good point. <laughs> 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 they always say check it might be me. I don't yeah. fucking believe this man. I, I really do, I saw the whole I thing. really don't believe this. What? Hey guys, Brian here. Hope you enjoyed the game. What a beautiful deep mate by Duck that he set up, man. Like, he set this up a couple moves back and he thought about this um, continuation a long, long time. Not, not, not even a couple moves back, like, I don't know, I mean, six, seven, eight moves back. And this was a very, very deep calculation to, to find. And this is a, I've never seen this mating pattern before with the, um, queen bishop and rook in this pattern but this will go into the mental database and i bet it will go into a lot of yours as well what a beautiful beautiful mate by duck here and man hats off to him this is he looked like it was toast man dave with the sneaky bishop queen battery here taking out h7 and it looked like um uh dave was gonna roll but duck just pulled this uh <laughs> pulled this out of nowhere and very very beautiful mate and we're gonna go over in the analysis um how dave could have defended it to defend it though it would be to to see the mate which is hard to see even in the first place so so the defense is there but it's hard to find and uh, we're gonna go over some other couple tactics where um, there might have been advantages and a really really good one this is a very uh, I, I once you see this tactic I'm about to show you this really juicy tactic you will never ever look at pawns the same again so strap in this is going to be a great analysis um, what a great game by these two man hope you guys enjoyed it let me know what you thought of it in the comments below if you want to get Duck a cup of coffee for that gorgeous mate his link is in the video description as well as Dave's um, check out all the other cool links there including the Amazon links to chess gear and don't forget to like share comment and subscribe hit that bell notification so you don't miss future videos all right, so let's go to this position, and in the game, bishop d7 was played. Let's go move back. Pause the video. will be another move for black here. All right, one idea for black is to play rook c2, um, attacking the queen, but also threatening a little something called checkmate. So 
bishop takes, rook takes, and queen takes, and it looks like white is toast, right? But white has a fighting chance here. White can play rook c1, and notice uh, black has a back rank weakness, so um, the bishop can't move. And even if the queen defends, then just rook here, rook here, and white will pick up the bishop. So create Luft, and this could be one continuation. Um, computer is black, better at negative 1.7. So, um, But let's go a little bit later on in the game here. And in the game, bishop b5 was played, and we saw that sneaky thing. Let's go move back. Yeah, just simply g6 here. D these bishops on the back rank are very, very hard to see. So, um, so they 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 work really well when you have this um, battery here, uh, with the, with the queen in front. So, um, but let's go. How does Dave close out the game? So, Dave is 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 winning here, and we're gonna get to this position. And in the game. Queen check was played. Let's go move back. Pause video will be another move for white here. Alright, white can play rook b1, turtling up. But you're thinking, what? Can't duck just play the same moves? Alright, let's 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 see what happens. Bishop c4. Now now white can play f5, queen a4, and look, it's the same setup at, at the end of the game. So white is toast, right? Here's the difference. What 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 Dave played before was queen here, which blocked the path for this pawn. This pawn is very important for this check because it allows the queen to get inside here. So um, king d8, and now the queen can invade. And what's going to happen is queen check. If king goes back, then you have the following queen check. And if king over, then you're just going to trade off queens, and these pawns are going to roll. So going back here um, instead of king b5 if king a5 then this is pretty nasty you're gonna have the check here and if king over then check and you're gonna pick up the queen so um, going back here so it looks like black's best option is to play king c, uh, king c7 and just kind of shuffle back and forth on these um, back two ranks but what black is gonna, I mean, what's, what white is gonna do is um, kind of test black a little bit here, and then we're gonna get to this position. And in the game, uh, what would you play as white here? Yeah, you gotta have balls to play, man. Queen takes bishop. Holy crap! What? What is the compensation? The compensation is these five connected well soon to be connected pass pawns along with this uh two rooks backing it up and this analysis i mean this continuation is going to go for a long time so i'm just going to go over one line to save time um basically white has to just push his pawns defend them with his pawns and his rooks and white black's going to try to play catch up here with um trying to take out the uh the pawns but It'll be too much. It's just the the pawns are swarming and the and the rooks are gonna get in good position. King has to watch out for the back rank there. So, and now um, it's just too much for uh, too much for 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 black to handle. But yeah, that is a beautiful beautiful line for white there. I don't think anybody would find that in a blitz game, or anybody would maybe oh, who would have the guts to take that and go into end game. Oh, take the bishop with the queen going to end game with those five connected passers, man. Soon to be, but yeah, that is a very, very cool line I want to show you guys. All right, so let's go here in this position and in the game f5 was played. Let's go move back. Pause the video. What would be another move for for White here? How does White save his position here? It's very deep. All right, the reason why this is hard to see is you have to see this mate in the first place, like I told you. So. Um, first off, it is queen h8 check, king d7. You run out of checks, right? But the purpose of that queen uh, h8 check is to get to h3, yes. So if black plays queen a4, then white can just play um, a3, queen takes, pawn takes, rook checkmate does not work because when queen takes, you have queen takes here, and queen bishop battery here to mate here does not work either because this queen is defending. So queen on this square defends the whole thing, holds the whole thing. So, But that's hard to see because you had to see the mate in the first place. And um, going back here, uh, let's see, 
and let's go move back pause the video what would be another move for white here for black here i'm sorry all right black can just play queen a3 this is an option too um if takes then this is mate so um this beautiful line there there are there are a lot of ways to win in this 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 uh position b3 then just mate here and if a3 then you can this is a pretty fancy way to win as well um can also go the just the queen bishop battery way but yeah this is a beautiful beautiful setup man i hope you guys memorize this with the queen rook and bishop and this this looks the white position looks impenetrable it looks like he's um solid but uh don't be fooled man what a great mate by duck that he found that's a very very beautiful one nicely done duck good game dave too man he found the uh little sneaky move here and was about to clean up but this mate is very very hard to see and hard to defend uh uh because of it so great game by these two hope you guys enjoyed it and the analysis please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe hit that bell notification and thanks i will see you guys later